Yo, yeah, what board are you guys thinking about going to tonight? Probably Ali as usual. Who's thinking the Legion tonight? The Legion tonight? Most people check into the Raven on Bar Wave. Bar Wave? Bar you girls don't know what Bar Wave is? Bar Wave is the first interactive nightlife app of our generation. It is going to be the next talent market for DJs and a talent place for bar owners to recruit talent to come to the bar for nightlife. I got the idea for it when I came back from Miami over the summer. Uh, just because I had a couple problems I always saw in college. Um, and then I figured out a way how to turn it you know, into a helpful way for everyone because as a college student you know you always wonder like what like best bars are around you where everyone's going and then I went on a trip to Miami and I realized you know I was with all my friends everything I needed for a great ass time but then we just didn't know where to go you know we got to Miami we're like there's no apps out there that show you where the people are going you know and I was just thinking of like how ways does it for driving so I just kind of got a couple ideas sparked off from that I just think a lot of I'm just listening to the people and you know a lot of people just been telling me to stick with it so I'm just gonna keep building it out and there's gonna be a lot more features coming soon getting it started you know I think was kind of the funnest part but the most difficult you know meaning one of my favorite books taught me that you don't always need funds to start a business you know if you really want to go after it you'll find a way and I knew that I didn't have enough money to start it, so what I did is I, for a month straight, was just going crazy looking for app developers, you know, trying to get people on board, and I found an app developer in Queens, you know, I got him all on board, he absolutely loves it, he's a co-founder of it, and then once I got him on board, I figured I needed to get someone who even knows more than I know um, in the tech world, so... I got one of our also co-founders is um, in the data analytics, and he you know runs all like terms of office on that side. And I knew that as a CEO, I would even need to get someone else too, because I think you need a team to you know to get this done. So I also have one of my co-founders who's our chief marketing officer who runs everything in marketing. But we laughs with each other sometimes, but you know. It's just good to have a team and strengths and weaknesses of everyone, you know, to find, like, the strengths where others won't be able to thrive as well as you. Yeah, so the layout for the app, this is just the most basic version we'll ever see. Uh, this is more of a proof of, con like, proof of concept stage. So it's just a very, like, basic layout right now. Um, it's just basically everywhere in the U.S. and Canada, you can see every bar around you that Google picks up. So... You know, right now we're just getting the idea into people's heads of just seeing, you know, a map with bars and everything around it. We're, we have some, like, features in there to see if people would actually, like, interact with each other. You know, the springtime was, you know, mostly proof of concept, but, you know, we didn't want to reveal all our best secrets yet. So, this springtime, we just wanted to, you know, build it out, learn the game, and the summertime is when it's going to grow really big and we're going to start going loose and just adding features every week. The future of Bar Wave, I, I would bet my life on it. I think that technology, you know, social media and everything is going to eventually take over and it's going to be valuable data that bar businesses are going to need to see. You know, Snapchat is already everyone's public, everyone can see where everyone's going. So I think that the future of Bar Wave is going to be the future of nightlife. I think that, you know, it's just a lagging market right now. You know, I, I don't think nightlife is caught up to technology. And I think that, you know, it's going to take some time, but they're eventually going to have to catch up to it. So I think we're building it into the future, getting ready for it. I see big things. Goals for Bar Wave. I just want to make a change, you know, honestly. Um, I just see the 
tech, you know, how fast technology is growing, everything around it, how easy it is to start a business now with social media. Everything right now is cheap in social media, but you know, and bar owners aren't even picking up on it. They're they're not even using their Instagram page. They're not like you know they're they're way behind, and it's just going to grow to a point in a couple of years from now. We're going to be building it out, listening to everyone, learning from everyone, and we're going to grow into the most valuable thing a bar owner could have. You know, he should know how many people are going in his bar every day. He should know what time people are going into his bar. You know, we're going to offer a cheap new social media platform like directed at nightlife, you know, and I think it's going to be, I think it's going to be us because every, you know, we have to start from the ground up and it's going to take time, but you know, technology grows with time and we're betting on technology. So getting a bar on board is, you know, all a sales pitch, meaning <laughs> I got all these bars to, you know, let us come in and make money for it. I, I, it kind of relates a lot to the frat and Greek life. I would think like, you know, it's so crazy. A function, you know, a fraternity or a sorority gets money for throwing a party at a bar. And then when I was thinking, you know, the app's going to take some time to build out. We're going to need to make some money in the meantime to, like, you know, build the business. And, you know, getting a bar on board is just simple. I mean, it's not simple, but it's just, you know, it's a sales. I got to tell them that I'll get a crowd there, you know. And this was all before, like, bar wave was even bar wave. This is with nothing. I would have to tell them that we're going to get a crowd there, that we're going to help out their Instagram. We're going to come in with our videographers, you know, make your place look unbelievable. And, you know, it, it was hard at first, but it's crazy how much credibility we have built. Because the hardest thing on a sales call is when you have no credibility. And, you know, throughout the time, we've earned up our credibility to go into, you know, Coastal Carolina and Senior Frogs, one of the greatest bar franchises out there. So... I think the biggest thing is getting bars on board is you guys sell them, um, sell them the vision, you know, and get them to understand that, you know, you could always do more for your business. Is the biggest thing. Current events is just get everyone to hear the name Bar Wave. You know, I think it's crazy in a college market. It's things travel so fast. We have stickers, you know, Bar Wave stickers, and you know. It might sound crazy, but it's, I think, the most efficient way to market. We throw parties at bars. At these parties, we go in with 500 stickers and give everyone a bar wave sticker, you know? So, like, I think any every event we go to, it just shows, too, on our data. Everyone, all the numbers shoot up in every city because, you know, you could pay money for ads. You could pay money for, you know, social media advertisement, Google advertisement, YouTube. But we just, you know focus on our events take it you know event by event and you know make amazing film with our videographers and we just really just sell like you know sell bar wave on stickers because it's they're so you know they're not expensive at all and it's like you can't like you know you could like show videos but we're physically just you know putting stickers on people you know it's like you can't go more marketing than that so there are a few competitors out there I think the biggest thing is where some of them got wrong is they haven't built a team, you know, because this is not going to be easy what I'm doing at all, and I know it's not, but I have the team that I know is going to have my back, and that's why we're going to make it to the top, you know. I think, um, you know, there isn't, other, there isn't any other interactive nightlife apps like Barwave, you know. I It's actually a fact. We are, like, you know, like, one of the only it's us and like someone else who just isn't relevant who has like a check-in but you know we got a lot more than that and I just don't think there it's that's why I'm into this there's really no other nightlife apps out there and <laughs> I just like see the gap right now and I just know like if someone's gonna make a big nightlife app I'm like I'd rather be me than someone else you know so I'm just focused on bar wave and nothing else she just moved to LA, go to UCLA, and she drive a Maserati. Then she got a body, she be trying to party. She be trying to party.